Hey there gents and gent at Spazzy here, aka Syndrimes, and welcome to episode 6 of our Avorian Let's Play. Today's episode is going to be kind of specific, because uh, we're going to very quickly go, vo go over our uh, immediate short-term uh, short goals, and I'm going to try and explain as to why and what and where and how. So, in in, in terms of the ships that we currently have and the resources, I think that this is, at this point, it's uh, time for us to focus a little bit more on kind of supplying our current fleet. So right now, if we take a look at this, we have four ships in total, one of them being uh, our main flagship, so to speak. We have the absurdity of uh, Pragmatism, and then we have three separate uh, mining ships. Uh, one of them, okay, mining ships and a salvager. So, okay, I'm kind of curious now. Is this thing going to take that one floating uh, module that just popped out? Because that was the one thing I really... I was really worried about. Okay, there we go, it picked it up. Okay, that's perfectly fine. Right, so, uh, the reason why I say that is because we're short on credits. We're fine on titanium, well, fine. 3,000, 3,500 titanium, that's fine. Uh, and we are, like, set for days for when it comes to iron. So I think what's going to happen is I'm going to mothball our flagship for a little while and we are going to focus a little bit more on exploration instead. Now in order to do so I will need to actually make a dedicated scouting ship which means that it'll have a radar, it's going to have a bypass in order to make sure that we don't need to make it large, we can uh, avoid any kind of danger simply by zipping away from it. And uh, so, what I guess uh, what we're going to be building in a moment is a shuttle, of so, so to speak. Now then, um, overall, I think that this at this point in time we also can do away, f um, uh, do away with the multiple small mining ships, and instead we can focus on a um, kind of like a singular mining barge. Not yet, though. I kind of want to wait for that until we find the R-type mining turrets, which will allow us to either, uh, actually gather and then refine the resources. So, yeah. So, I think what's going to happen is I'm going to take this little shippy of ours. Actually, we're picking up quite a few salvage turrets. So that's all these good. Something like that. I'm gonna wait until this thing finishes up with the salvage. Actually, I'm not. So, let's quickly go back to that ship. I will need to borrow its, um, its radar system. But in order to do that, I actually need to find a... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Okay, there it is. It, it was right in front of me. Let's go demount this thing. So, the potential danger that we currently have is the idea that we might not have enough money to actually pay our crew. Because in total we have four captains, and even though only one of these ships has the size of the crew that is, you know, worth worrying about right now, it is still a thing that is gonna happen. So, there we go. I'm going to unmount this. I'm going to pretty much mothball the 
Well, not mothball. I, I guess there's no point in actually doing anything about it. It's going to very slowly regenerate its health over time. And I'm going to make this ship of ours into that exploratory ship. So, in order to do so, I do want to make it kind of appealing. Uh, oh, yeah, and uh, I am going to leave the the commander on the ship because just in case I come across a place with some very choice materials I will want to make a very small you know mining ship and I can give it this ship's captain so let's do the thing so what I want to do that's a titanium engine and an iron hull. Oh, this is still our iron engine. That's uh, uh, iron ship. That's actually pretty good. So first things first, uh, we're going to go with a titanium integrity fuel generator that is actually large enough to cover the whole ship, if needed be. I'm going to add one... Oh, yeah, this is where we are going to encounter that particular problem. We actually don't have the resources needed to do this. Am I docked? No, no I'm docked. Okay, let's trade equipment. I want to sell a few things just for the sake of being able to, you know, upgrade that ship. So let's sell this thing. Uh, what else do I have? Hyperspace upgrades that we don't need. A mining system we're gonna keep. We're gonna sell the worst of the two bypasses. Something like this. 35,000, that should be enough. If we need more, I will deal with that. But yeah, let's go back. So, as I was saying, generator. Boom. To also go for titanium engines. The reason why I'm going like this is just for the sake of design. Like, this has absolutely no impact on why or how. Actually, let's make it slightly sleeker. There you go, more crew quarters, just in case. The integrity field is, in fact, covering the whole item, so that's cool. Let's kind of make it like this, I guess. Now this thing is just going to be like a shuttle. And so with that in mind, I think the rest is just going to be... Just for the sake of uh, visual... We don't actually have a lot of titanium, do we? Okay, iron is. Like it, it's it's not like this is going to help much. Again, this is just for the sake of having the ship be slightly more appealing than it otherwise is. So let's see what we can do about it. I have a rough idea of how I want this to look. 
and all I hope it's not a waste. Okay, so this is the part where... Huh. So I'm not exactly sure, but I think this is one of the places where this sort of edge might be best. Yeah, there we go. This is definitely the shape that I'm looking for. Yeah, something like that. I mean, this looks pretty interesting. And at least in a moment, I, I'm not going to call it the test anymore. Like, it's actually going to get a proper name. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. This place needs to be... No, not crew quarters. Why can't I have triangular crew quarters? It has to be iron hull with windows. Oh, but it's also a block. Eh. Kind of silly that that's the case, but I mean, there we go. There we go. That kind of looks neat. I don't want to go overboard, but I do want to make it at least somewhat pleasing to the eye. Now, whether or not I actually... like, succeed in doing so, that's obviously another question altogether. Something like that. And honestly, the the bottom of this thing that doesn't have to be too too elaborate let's set it like to two like this let's remove that thing and let's just cover all of it as much as we can something like this just regular armor plates as much as we can anyway Yeah, this is perfectly fine. I mean, this is this is not going to be very elegant. But the thing is, it, it is going to do its job at protecting the ship from, you know, from those sides. And that is honestly all I can ask for it. So what about the front? What kind of front do I want? I'm probably going way too overboard, like it's been 13 minutes already. I'll try not to go too much into detail. Uh, try. Kind of boring. If it has to be a shape like that... It might as well be something like that. Yeah, there we go. Right, so with that in mind... Oh, no, 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 we can't have this. This has to be, look... This, this has to be... 
neat and tidy. Ah, oh, seriously. <laughs> I'm totally going overboard at this point. I know, I know. Like, there is absolutely no need that this thing is going to be... Ah, oh, seriously? There we go. Okay, that 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 is fine. Okay. Let's let's stop. Let's stop while we are still ahead. So, maneuvering. Something like that. Although with all the slanted armor pieces, placing down these things is going to be slightly more problematic than it should. As I simply didn't... Didn't give it a... <laughs> didn't leave it a lot of places for that sort of thing. So I guess I'll just have to make sure that every single bit counts. As much as I can, anyway. Something like that. Yeah, this is... this is gonna be fine. I have a feeling that this thing is not going to have any amount of maneuver maneuverability at all. Especially side to side. But then again, I don't think it will have to. Let's see. Oh yeah, that's a... That's a lot of miners and nothing else. I think I even know why. Oh. Yeah, I'm at a ship that is physically incapable of stopping. Okay. There's one way to fix this. Now, it's not going to be pretty. Let's make it the same height, at least. There we go, directional thrusters. Something like that. I mean, as long as I have more surfaces to place these things on... ...that's going to be good enough. See what I mean? And now that I have these surfaces to place it on, that's going to be much better. And there we go. After this, the ship should have the capability of actually roll and pitch. It's just a little bit uglier than before, but that's perfectly fine, I guess. Well, the only thing that I'm going to add here is... Wait! It looks like only the blank hull has the additional parts. Ah, uh, it becomes red after I... 
Extended a little bit too much. Uh, what about the edge? It's not perfect, but it'll do the job. Unless I make it just slightly deeper. Can I make... God fucking damn it. It's six. Wait. I got confused. Okay, there we go. I didn't mean this thing to be a build episode, so really, really sorry about this. There we go. Boom. I like this design. I like what I'm looking at. Of course, this still means that uh, we do need more. Where is it? Come on, docking. Become duck. Oh. Oh no. Do not... do the thing. Okay, let's hire some crew. Let's... let's see, ten of them? Oh yeah, this... 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 this will be fine. Okay, let's see, what did I need? First of all, yeah, let's get this over in. Bypass, and a radar. And we actually seem to be able to mount one more, so hey, why not? And boom, bish bash boosh, we have ourselves a scout. And as for the name... We can finally give it a name. <laughs> a ship with a view. Welcome to the fleet. Let's very quickly give it a interesting enough coloring. Something like that. And from the top... Something like that. I'm sorry, I, I'm really sorry that I'm wasting the time, but if I'm going to fly this thing for a while, it has to be pretty. If I'm going to be staring at its ass, it might as well be a nice ass to stare at. Yeah. There we go. A ship with a view. It's uh, slightly thicker than I hoped it would be. But there we go. Okay, 25 minutes. So, let's go exploring. Um, I have a feeling that this is not the right... No. Show sectors where the mass is yellow blips. Uh, do we just not have yellow mass things here? That would certainly be slightly strange. So emergency call. We're not gonna go for that. Let's see how this thing jumps around. It shouldn't really take a lot of energy out of it.
One of the other things that I have in store for the Pragmatist in specific is going to be the idea that I have to... So what is this? This is a connection. That I'll have to turn it into a troop transport of sorts. East, southeast. That is one thing. Uh, where is it? I don't see it on a map. Oh, that's because it's right in front of me. North, northwest. Is that it? Yeah. So yeah, um, turn it into a troops, uh, troops transport. So, as time goes on, I'm obviously not going to keep mining iron, right? So those ships will have to kind of go with me. Unless I build them into some sort of large dedicated mining ship at some point soon, I would rather have them be small mobile things that I can disassemble. If that makes any sense. Disassemble and reassemble in a place where I, you know, have to. So, I'm not really sure what to do about it. Okay, let's see. What do we have? Okay, we have a wormhole again. That is neat. I don't see any particular claimable asteroids here. Yet, anyway. And no crates, no stashes, as far as I can see. What about this side of the field? Nothing here yet. Okay, so what do you have? Okay. Oh, that would be actually... Okay, so that is one of the... Hmm. Yeah. I'd really like this thing. Actually, I would like both this and this. Because once we actually do make that dedicated mining barge thing... Having one of these uh, blue upgrades would actually be very, very good. So... What do you think? Okay, so... Stop. Become, stop. So, Absurdity Pragmatism, I need you to kind of... Patrol sector. That thing is still mining. That thing is also still mining. Okay, with that in mind, let's go. Into the unknown. Into the abyss. We have entered slightly closer to the edge of the uh, to the center of the galaxy. And so the cool thing about this ship is that even if we jump into a system with a lot of, you know, bad people, the fact that I have a engine limit bypass means that I can easily avoid damage. So I don't have to scout with my... Hello? Power unit factory, interesting. These are not the same people, so the Exayev versus the Anul. Okay. That is very interesting, he said. Not really interesting, but that is a thing that is. A quick visual. So right now I'm looking for specifically claimable asteroids because soon enough we'll have to start paying for those um, well everything really and I'm sad to say that right now I'm not actually going to go using any of the gates because the gates you need to pay for the for using the gates and I would rather not do that Especially since we have this. You're flying through clear space, and so the energy... Sorry, the warp drive cooldown is reduced. 
So that is amazing. Like, I, I really love that. That is one of the best things. Like, that is literally one of the best changes they've done. And I'm going to use full advantage of it. Okay. That is interesting. Are you coming for me? You call this a ship? Well, like a dump. Well, screw you two. So one of the things they have done, and I'm not exactly sure if it's for the best, but apparently you're not gonna get attacked by them unless you approach. So that is their, you know, recent conquest. They're disassembling those ships, and if I approach, then, only then, will they attack. Well, okay then. If you don't want to play with me, I know. Uh, I'll just take my leave. Open doors create unnecessary suction. Yes, we always need always need to be sure that we have the only the necessary amount of suck. Nothing worth mentioning here. What else do we have? Yeah, exploration right now is actually going to be quite a bit faster. Simply due to the fact that you don't have to wait for long in completely empty sectors. Asking for clearance. Okay, what do we have here? This seems to be one of the standard systems. And I don't really see any... Any interesting things here. And since this is not our main, you know, battleship, you know, battle, you know, combat ship, I'm hesitant to just, you know, jump into something. That being said, I'm also not really wanting to use those gates. Like, I haven't found a single claimable asteroid just yet. So let's keep doing that. There we go. Is he, like, nine seconds per completely empty sector, that's perfectly fine. How's that, you know, like 500? At some point I want to kind of create this thing, like, remove all the iron and give it, like, some norm... Oh, that's a lot of sectors. Yeah, uh, at some point, like, I wanted this, I, I want to turn this ship into pure titanium just for the sake of being slightly more maneuverable. Ooh, hello. Okay, so that is a thing that exists in the system. But my question here... Ooh, hello. Uh, that is an hole. And I would actually really like to take it, if not for the fact that I need credits more than I need resources, and the only reason why I would want to take a wormhole right now is if I really wanted to... If I really wanted to go out and explore for new resources. Which is, again, not the case. So, that is a station wreckage. My question is... Do I have... Yes, I do have a titanium salvage turret. Which... I... I think I have... Something to... Like... I had a titanium something to place it on. Don't I? Oh, there we go. I 
want to very quickly check what can we get from this thing. I think one of the changes they've done is that these stations don't have these very large chunks of things anymore, so disassembling them is in fact much better to be done with a, you know, like a drone, an automated ship or something like that. So with that in mind, I'm kind of tempted to see what can I... Is that cargo? That is cargo. And I think we might even have some cargo space. No, we don't. Hey, <laughs> let's change that. No, 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 no. And I know exactly the parts that need to go in order to do that. Can you please become... yes. So, how much of this can I pick up? I've gained four vegetables! Ha! <laughs> well, I'm getting titanium for it. Not a lot of it, but titanium, nonetheless. Technically speaking, I could leave this ship and just salvage a little bit, or create a small little one. Like, this thing is pure titanium. Though, honestly, right now, I think the best choice would be to leave this thing once I have our mining turrets. Yeah, that's, that's probably going to be for the best. Yeah, uh, let's do it like this. Um, add note. Station salvage. I think that at some point when I actually do get that, uh, do get the ability to salvage with our types, that's... Like, th at that point, it's probably not going to be all that relevant to me. I'm probably going to be in, like, Trinium or something. Jesus Christ, we almost have 200,000 iron. And at this point, I still haven't, like, made any money. So, yeah, next episode, we'll just have to keep on hunting for money. Okay, where the hell am I? Uh, I am on the opposite side of the everything. Which was really interesting back then, not so interesting now. Because the whole point was to... The whole point was to explore. And that's what we're going to do. Okay, I think we have enough time for one more jump before I have to end this episode. So let's do it. Hello? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Another one? Okay. Screw it. Let's see where you take us. Ooh, I like this. 
You're too close to the center of the galaxy. I like this. Again, the cool thing about a ship like this is that I have zero offensive capability, but I don't ha I, I don't have to have it. <gasps> Hello. Wreckage. Wreckage. I want to know what it is. Okay, first of all, what else do we have here? Is this just wreckage? Yes. Looks like this is just wreckage. Show me what you have. Ooh, I see some green bits. Oh yes. Neonite. My friends, we have just found Neonite. Sadly, this means only one of my turrets is actually doing something right now. The other one is not really doing anything. So, my question is... Does the ship type have any exposed systems? That I would be aware of. Okay, first of all, let's dismount the iron salvaging turret because I have a feeling like it, it, it's it's a waste. Hmm. Let's see. The design of this thing is over elaborated. Oh, I think I see some systems. Placing it on the bottom was a mistake, but that is the only place where I actually have some titanium. So, yeah. Okay, that's very nice and all. What else do we have here? I kind of want to see if these things... ...maybe have some exposed systems that I could easily salvage very quickly. Okay, that is titanium. Noted. The designs, though. These designs look amazing. Although that kind of looks like iron. Unless it is not. One way to find out. Well, no, that's definitely Neonite. Yeah. Okay. Um, I will just probably have to... I mean, I might as well do it right now. Salvage Drone 1. Let's scale the ship down. Like, become small. Chain gun, iron, double iron, iron. Oh, yeah. The thing is on this thing. So, become no. <laughs> yeah, uh, let's make it even smaller. 
Yeah, there we go. So, this thing is gonna have a titanium salvage turret. And that's about it. What the hell? There we go. Directional thrusters, also for the sake of stopping. Oop. And... Transfer... Uh, one captain... Crew 9 out of 10. Oh, right, 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 I know what's happening. I don't have the auto-assign. Actually, I don't want the auto-assign right now. Now I want the auto-assign. There we go. I like how zippy this thing is. Okay, go salvage. New. <laughs> Look at it go. Yeah, okay, this is it. Right, guys, thanks for joining me. Uh, in the next episode, I will try to do my best to actually make money, because, um... This is going to take a while, as you can see, since we only have one titanium salvaging turret, and you need titanium to salvage Neonite. But yeah, thanks for sticking with me, and I will see you in the next episode.